What's up everybody? I wanted to do an update video on the new home I'm going to be living into and actually truly give you guys a house tour slash land tour. So first things first you're going to see in the middle of the day now since it's not dead at night, I have a fire pit. I actually dug out a fire pit with my stepbrother. We dug this out, we lined it up with river rocks, we got center blocks, we still need to build it up. But you know we made a fire pit. That's the first thing that you know I'm going to be doing. We actually pulled out a log here to be able to uh, cut this right here, cut this and turn this into like a bench, like raise it up and turn it into a bench. Well, I was cooking hot dogs out here, as you can see, here's a, a little poking stick, shoveling out ash as well, because you know, it does build up. But to get basically on point though, this is gonna be my new home. I wanna have a new place to record videos. It's a house to myself because you know, I've been with my dad for a while and helping him out, he's helped me out. And I finally am gonna have a place of my own. It's a, uh, it's a little bit, it's a little bit scary. Not gonna lie. It's gonna be a, uh, it's gonna be a weird experience knowing that I don't have, you know, anyone around. It, it, that's the reason why I'm actually gonna be getting a dog. But I'm just walking around the property. If you're wondering, I'm just, you know, walking around. But uh, this is, um, it's a nice feeling. Scary though. But I finally have moved all my stuff in. Got like everything inside the house right there. <sighs> it's been a long, long week, months actually. I've been working on this here. I'll uh, zoom in the quality for you to see it better. Been working on this for about, I would say, a good two years now. It's been a long process. If you watched my old vlogs a long time ago, you'll know that this house never had a porch on it, which now it does. It had a porch put on. You know, I, if you remember the old video, I was talking about like the lines. Like, see here. Here's like the water lines that was put in and I had to dig out pipes. It's going all the way over to there. It's going way back over to the road, way over there. But basically, yeah, if you remember from the past, you'll know I recorded a video of like a shell of this. Like there was like no electrical in there. It was just being put in. There was like really no walls, but a back porch was added as you can see here. You know, me and my dad and then a couple others that I had to actually ask for help to get this all done. It's It's been a very long, long process right in there that's a utility room well that's a trash can you see right there now um just fyi what you're gonna see here some of the stuff hasn't been completely picked up like i need to organize it like this is what i was moving my stuff in on the manga i was using that got some leftover wood and all that and you know different things trash can you know cabinet that needs to be installed it's so listening to jojo on that you know dustpan now this is uh this is the utility room now Yes, I know, it's scary. There's a lot of stuff in here. This is basically tools and stuff we've been using, like tiles are down there. That's, you know, grouting, all of that. Got the reciprocating saw, you know, <laughs> I got a lot of stuff in here. And that's, yeah, that's the bathroom, as you can see in there, which I'll show you in a second. But yeah, it's, uh, yeah, it's a mess. But I'll organize it in due time. Now, over here, as the utility room, washer and dryer finally hooked up. Had to get these bad boys. Sadly, one's like a... You know, just a regular at like LG. I, yeah, this is LG right here. And then this one is a uh, General Electric. But yeah, it's been a very long process to get everything. Let me go to the front of the house and actually just show you around the land real quick before I go inside and give you guys a house tour. But uh, yeah, all this, as far as you can see back there, that's the, my land. That's going to be my land. Now, FYI, I don't technically like, oh, well, I, I'm going to have probably bad quality here guys so forgive me if I look a little bit blurry but basically this right here all this land I am trying to get it to own it and this right here I don't own it yet like I'm having to do a contract and all that me and my dad were working on it to get this and all that and one day hopefully he can set up his own house somewhere way over there or something but it's it's been a long process like I said it's a two-year thing it's it's been <laughs> it's been hard very hard, a lot of sweat, time, all of that just to get all this going. But it's uh, it's beautiful. This is really, really beautiful. Now there is a road over there. That's the cars you're probably hearing. It's not too far. It's not too close. I do have privacy on the property. Um, hopefully you guys can see. But all these trees, like that fence over there, you can probably make out a fence. When you get to that fence, that's the end of this property here, my property. But it goes way back there, like way back there that direction. Now anyways, this is the side of the house. 
from this way, as you can see here. That's uh, the electric meter and then the internet hooked up right there. And yeah, so that's the outside of the property. I know it's a small looking house and it, it really is being honest, but you know, it'll do for me. Being by myself, having no one, it's not really that bad. Now, uh, let's go inside this bad boy. So I got a welcome mat, as you can see, my work boots. I also got my messed up, you know, painted over Crocs I've been using. My little socks are mismatched, but who really cares about that? <laughs> okay, so this is the bottom floor. Hopefully the lighting is good. Hopefully the audio is good. Please forgive me. Now there is some things, as you automatically can see, that are not necessarily finished. Like this, this I want to rip all out. Like I want to take all this out and replace it with a new countertop. I want to have all of this because if you look very closely, there's paint all over it and this right here is kind of like jank this was this has been here for a while but basically I want to get a new countertop I want to be able to have a nice one but that's for another time my pots and stuff are down there my plates and all that look at this man got a got my anime cups spice wolf jojo all sorts of stuff up there just to be able to drink out of and here's my uh a little food knickknacks right here. Hopefully you guys can make that out. But it's just little stuff. It's not a lot of like space. Like it's not a massive house. But like I said, for just me, it's fine. Oven, as you can see right here. And then that's a mini fridge. I'm going to replace that out with like a table that goes all the way here. Where I can put my microwave down and my coffee maker. Yeah, that's that's my little flip phone. Uh, yeah, actually I use this dinosaur. Keys. And right now just general storage until I find a place for all of that. Refrigerator, as you can see here, got some stuff on I still need to organize, and I need to get a table over here for my router and my uh, my modem. That's a router I also got as a backup in case this one goes down, and that's my heater. Now, I know it's not a built-in, you know, central air and heat, but that's it on a 220 plug-in. That is powerful. It heats this house up quickly. Sadly, there is no... AC like there, there's no AC so I'm gonna have to use a window unit like I did in the other house But thank God you know what there's insulation. There's actual insulation in here. It's not newspaper it, it, It's it's not newspaper. So it's great. Yes, the cord situation could be a lot better. Oh, yeah, and there's my other shoes So let's show you guys the bathroom now this There's still some things that need to be done in here. It's not perfect But there is been a lot of time spent in here. So here's the shower. It's a uh, it's a very narrow gap as you can see It's a it's very narrow but it's not necessarily bad because it's a small house. It, it's a really small house. I mean, here, let me show you. I mean, make sure the uh, you guys can see me up close real quick. I'm just adjusting it. Okay. So, see, it's it's kind of small right here. It's small, but it's it's fine for me since I'm so tiny. I'm, you know, only 5'4", five, 5'3". Five, it doesn't really bug me at all. So, yeah. Now, anyway, showing you around. So, this is a new sink I put in. This had a old jank sink like this sink right here looked worse than that okay it looked worse than that i got this replaced and all that put a new sink in and it's uh here i'm trying to get the quality for you i'm sorry but um got a mirror because i haven't actually installed a mirror yet oh yeah the wall put in full cedar full cedar planks oh it smells so good <laughs> it really does in here i guess it's good if you know you're using the bathroom or whatever but uh yeah so toothpaste you know brush my cologne, you know, that's the utility room. I, you know, once again, to explain this, as I did my other vlog, that was an afterthought, that utility room there. And when we installed the bathroom, we didn't think too much about the utility room. We're like, oh, well, we already have a window, so we just did it. But one of these days, I plan to, like, maybe remove this, put a door here somehow, like, expand the bathroom, put a door here for I have a utility room. But, yeah. Now, here is my bath towels. I got, uh, quite a bit. Toilet paper, all of that. It's, um... Yeah, a lot of animu, <laughs> you know, back out. Spice of Wolf, they got, you know, um, they got all sorts of anime in here, and regular towels. A lot of duplicate Spice of Wolf towels, by the way. Like, it's, it's kind of crazy. Now, my shower, here's my shower. It's uh, nothing fancy. It's not like a bathtub, massive and all that, like everybody's used to. I still need to clean it a little bit out because we were still working in here. But basically, bathroom is finished. Put up cedar up here and all that, as you can see. 
It's not perfect, but it will do. Now, I know many of you are wondering about the light situation. I actually got a light installed here, as you can see. A little touch light. So, it's beautiful. We turn that off. Okay. But that is the bathroom. It's, it's very beautiful. It's really beautiful. I love it. I really, really love this bathroom. Okay, so the moment you've been waiting for. Let's go up to my room. Oh, yeah. Actually, before I do. These steps, still got to work on them. I got to put carpet on them. And I want to fix them up. It, this is one of the last things I'm probably going to do. Electric box, obviously. There's things that still need to be done. Water heaters down there. But, uh, okay. So, there's going to be some things I'm not going to be able to show on this wall right here. Because YouTube wouldn't like that. So, I'm going to have to either put a picture on screen to block it. Or I'm just going to have to zoom over it. But there is some things on these walls I can't show you. Because, let's just say it's related to uh, some form of... Uh, cultured individuals but okay so avoiding that this is my Kaneki Ken wall scroll that someone sent me a long time ago I have it right there now kind of making it to where you don't see these other posters so the Attack on Titan and uh, Railgun right there kind of changing into the different outfits Gintama right there now I can't show you that one but I can show you this one right here so there's Spice and Wolf there's Kaneki Ken Manga collection, zooming around. My old, old noble team statue from Halo Reach. Then head pats on George. I still gotta pick up some things here, as you can see. Gotta put a light, and that's the boxer asana. But here is my corner of my room. So this right here is pretty much all BD DVD. Like, actually, this is all DVDs and music CDs. And yeah, so there's no BDs in this area. But there's quite a bit. Let me uh, get in a better position for you can see here. So here you go. Let me go to the top shelf in case you didn't see it. Now it's not alphabetical. It's not really completely organized. I want to be honest. It just I needed to get it in to be able to move to start making videos again. Oh yeah, that's that's there. <laughs> um, you didn't see that. Anyways, you got all this right there. And then this is like more wall scrolls and stuff I need to put up. But this is uh, more manga and anime over here. All, you know, just DVDs. All in here. Collection, JoJo music, Fate music, stuff like that. Now here's my game shelf. Most of the time I have digital now. I actually don't do a lot of physical copies anymore. I don't know. But uh, here's my DS. My Wii games. You know, PlayStation 4. Xbox 360 and 1 games. Got quite the collection from Xbox 360 days. Let me set up. But as you can see, that's what it looks like. One of my favorite games right here is Catherine. That's such a good game. But yeah, quite a bit. There is my katana. There's Lost Sword and Ichigo Sword from Bleach. So carrying over. Okay, I can show all this. So here's my manga. Let me uh, make the camera good. There you go. Attack on Titan. It's not in alphabetical order either. Still need to adjust it and all that. But, uh, Shaman King, Claymore, you know, Spice and Wolf, more Shaman King, Love and Hell, uh, No Longer Human, Bakuman, Blackbird, you know, uh, I got, uh, Seven Deadly Sins, Seven Deadly Sins right here, Skip Beat, Solanine, One Piece, I need more One Piece. Full Metal Alchemist, as you can see. Got Ronan Kishin, or Kenshin, I, I just butchered that. Alice, PhD, Fantasy Degree, Pretty Face. Here, let me uh, fix that quality there. Pretty Face, Zatch Bell, you know, uh, New World and all that. Got Vinland Saga, more Full Metal. You know, I got uh, Poon Poon. Got more Ronan Kenshin, Vagabond. Got a bunch of stuff. Uh, about Black. Now, looking at this stuff, th this stuff looks organized, it is, but there's still a lot of things that need to be done. I still need to do a lot of organization, but uh, I got a lot of manga in here. There's Kaneki's Mask. Fan mail's in there. Got some fan mail letters all in there. Still need to bring more over. This magazine right here is the last, last time Naruto was ever in. Uh, this is the last time Naruto was ever in you know, Weekly Shonen Jump. This was the final time right here. It's crazy to think that this is the last time it ever aired. And then, look how old this is. Like, this has One Piece with Corazon. 
in it. Corazon, and it has even the Nomu fought with All Might. That's crazy how old that is. But, uh, yeah, that's, um, that's, uh, old stuff. Negima's down here and other, like, miscellaneous series like Gantz and stuff. Monster Moves made. There's a lot of series. After going through my collection, I have a lot of anime and manga that don't have, like, everything a part of it. So I need to start collecting the individual volumes, like Monster Musume, JoJo, and stuff like that. Got Black Bullet back there. Got the Monogatari series, Store Online. All of ReZero from what I've collected back there. You know, I got No Game, No Life. You know, I got Puck back there. Little figure. I need to get, uh... I, I've lost his sword, sadly. I lost King Arthas's sword. Makes me very, very, very sad. But I got all the Zelda manga. I got, um, you know, my youth romantic comedy, Children of the Wells. I got a bunch of stuff here like Hack and all that, Ubel Blatt, Dance and the uh, Vampire Bun. All a Pandora Hearts. This is, this is crazy because I actually own all of the single edition volumes of Pandora Hearts and the limited edition Pandora Hearts, which had the special limited run. I can't show you down here because that is hentai. Anyways, this is uh, Food Wars. And you have, you know, is it wrong to pick up girls in a dungeon? One Punch Man. You know, little stuff. Roka. You got Railgun back there. Index. And then here's UQ Holder right here. We, then that's a, uh, if you know me, you know why. But uh, basically, yeah, that's Japanese. I got Blood Lad back there. You know, I got quite a bit. Tokyo Ghoul. All of Tokyo Ghoul I have. So, quite a bit here. Japanese editions and English editions. This is a uh, meat bag that Rize had, and this is uh, this is Sukiyama's like tissue bag where he sniffs into it. But that's that. And then here is the limited edition Tokyo Ghoul cards that came out, and then a little mini Toka. My Berserk collection, all of Berserk I currently own quite a bit. All of the volumes, as you can see there, it's uh, makes me happy to have this. Makes me really happy. And then little figurines. On the side, right here, I still need to pull them out of their box and, like, uh, adjust them. And so let's look at my computer setup. So where I do all my work or what I will be doing all my work. So this is uh, Twitter, as you can see right here. Hopefully you can make that out. But, uh, yeah, this is um, this is my computer setup. My mouse pad with Saber, my Hello wallpaper, Vagabond. And yes, my core situation's bad. My tablet, my glasses, my Xbox, my little lamp for that, for lighting. Because I'm probably going to record here in my chair. Yes, I got rid of the big fat chair. And I'm going to be using this. I'm probably going to record sideways. And you guys are probably going to have an image kind of like that, kind of. Now, bed. That's my bed. It's king size. It's, uh, yeah. So let's look at my figurine collection. So, I have a lot here. I did not know I had this many figurines until I went over it and started placing them all down. It's kind of ridiculous. I was really blown away by how many figures I actually had in here. There's a lot of fate figures, by the way. I was like, oh my god, like, there's a lot. There's a, a lot of fate figures. And, um, that's the music box to Pandora Hearts. And then here's limited edition figures of like Holo and all that in there. Toradora. And then my poster right there. So yeah, that's uh that's my room. So let me um let me do an outro. So you guys, hopefully you have enjoyed this little house tour slash land tour. I know many of you might not care about it, and I know many of you might be upset with the new background because it's it's iconic. It's what I've had all the time since I've been a YouTuber, but, you know, I needed to move, I need a new place, and yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoy it, hopefully you guys like this video, let me know, um, I love you guys, have a wonderful day or night wherever you live, if you enjoy my content, please subscribe, if you like this video, please leave a like, and if you want to get notified for whenever I upload a video, please click the bell icon down below, and with that, chibi out.